Hold up, wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished? Not yet, baby. Who knew that rapper Meek Mills was not just a rapper from Philly, he was also an agent, a middleman, a liaison, a negotiator. Who knew? Well, I guess we do now because Albert Breer reported today and because of course you know the owners they having the owners meeting right now just finding out how they can keep most of their money how they can continue to keep most of their money while taking care of some of the players here and there but anyway anyway uh, albert Breer reported that patriots owner robert Kraft, he said that meek mills texted him three or four days ago and of course you know robert Kraft super close with me with meek mills they've been close for years uh, but anyway robert Kraft said that meek mill texted him three or four days ago saying lamar jackson wanted to come to new england and I was like, oh, okay. All right, well. New England has continued to be named as like this secret team that could come in and swoop in for Lamar Jackson. Uh, and it would be sort of an under-the-radar team, a team that's not getting a lot of attention. Because right now, there's been a lot of talk about the Colts, obviously. Um, and then, I mean, Larry Mitunso, he's trying to get some stuff started up about the Texans because he tweeted away. He said, hey, come to the city, baby. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Because, again, anything is possible. Till it ain't possible no more And then there's still a the possibility That Lamar Jackson stays with the Ravens Even though I don't really think it's likely I don't, Anyway and we'll talk about that more tomorrow But anyway uh, Let's get back to this report A Patriots owner Robert Kraft said Meek Mill texted him three or four days ago Saying Lamar Jackson wanted to come to New England Now this answer is what got me This response Said Kraft responded That would be Bill Belichick's decision So I thought that was slightly significant. Reason being because normally, even, even just a couple minutes ago, a GM in that same division, a uh, Jets GM, I think, or Joe Douglas, who used to be with the Ravens. But anyway, he was asked about Lamar Jackson. And he said, oh, no, that would be disingenuous of me to get engaged with contract talks with Lamar Jackson, da 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 Basically because they're going after Aaron Rodgers. And, I mean, that's something that we expected to already be done by now. But it ain't done by now. So we'll see what happens then. But Robert Kraft, and this wasn't just a regular deflection, because he could have deflected this and be like, oh, no, he's a Baltimore Raven. I'm sure that situation will work itself out. But for him to say that would be Bill Belichick's decision, it's like you, you didn't shut it down. We, we also so used to GMs, like when they get a question like that about another player, if, even if this player is available via trade, even if this player requested a trade, Usually you hear so many GMs, so many head coaches and whatnot, they shut it down right away. They say, no, we're, either we're not interested or we got a lot of our own stuff going on. We can't worry about that right now. Nope. <laughs> that would be Bill Belichick's decision. So he not only deflected it, but he deflected it to somebody within the same organization. And we know Bill Belichick makes a lot of the decisions for the New England Patriots. So that would be something. I'm just thinking about it. It would burn. It would hurt really, really, really bad. Uh, I mean, wherever he goes, it's going to hurt really, really bad to see Lamar Jackson uh, play for another team if that ends up happening. I know, of course, with Ian Rappaport, his most recent report, you know a lot of people thinking, whoa, whoa, wait a minute, buddy. Lamar may not go nowhere. Even though I'm still thinking that he's going to be gone. But again, we'll discuss that later. But we'll see. We'll see. So, whether we end up seeing Lamar Jackson play for the Ravens, that would be a beautiful dream. Or if we see him play for the Patriots or anybody else, it will go from a dream to a nightmare. Shout out Meek Mills. We out.